what is leadership? Is it being the boss under the hierarchical triangle? No. One does not have to be at the top to be a leader. In fact, you don't even need to be on the hierarchical triangle at all to be a leader. Leadership is more akin to a spear. No beginning, no end, traveling in every direction. Leaders inspire people to do better. Heck, they inspire others to become leaders. I mean, if you truly ask yourself, have I ever been inspired? You probably said yes. So from there, you could say something must have inspired whomever inspired you. It could be anything, even you. You could have inspired them, or we inspired them at some point. Only they will ever really know. I mean, it shouldn't really matter who inspired what, in what order. Like I said, leadership is like a sphere. No beginning, no end. Traveling in every direction. A few of my values that tie into my beliefs are thus. Everyone is equal through their inequalities. Let me explain. Let's say we have two guys, Jake and Kevin. If we compare their intelligences, Jake wins. And when you compare strengths, Kevin wins. But when you compare all the values as a whole, they are equal. This all leads into my second value. By working together, we can achieve more by covering each other's weaknesses. So far, Example, when Jake and Kevin work together, Jake is able to come up with plans, while Kevin provides the strength needed to educate the plans. Together, they're able to achieve things they never could on their own. <sighs> Finally, the only way to improve the way things are done is to challenge the new idea, the old ideas with new ones. Like, for instance, the wheel. The wheel's changed a lot over its years of existence. We could have just stopped at any point and said it's good enough. We could have stopped when we first met it, but no, instead, we said we can make it better. And we did. And we will continue to do that with everything there is. My leadership style is the kind that does not require me be at the top, but when I am, I can be flexible and listen to those under me. And, but, when I must, I can be unmoving, like a sturdy tree. Otherwise, I would make suggestions to a leader when I believe I have a good idea and it is an appropriate time to do so. When it comes time to fulfill my leadership responsibilities, the first thing is to brainstorm ideas and keep only the ones that do not infringe on the moral rights of people. Then it is figuring out which ideas create the most good in the window of time we have available. Once an idea has been decided on, who works with who, on what, will be decided based on strengths, weaknesses, personalities, and preferences. After that, I would set up a timeline in order to make sure the goal is accomplished within a time limit. <sighs>